So what's up mga kawaiti? It's your girl Angela and today as you see the title, ang gagawin natin is the essential things you need for online classes. Since ayun nga magiging online na lahat ngayon kasi 'di ba may kinakaharap tayong pandemic. Ayun, mahalaga na malaman natin kung paano natin magagamit ng ayos yung oras natin and also para tayong magiging productive during this kind of situation. If you're new to my channel, don't hesitate to subscribe and also show me some love by hitting the like button and also turning on the notification bell para every time na I have new upload is manonotify ka. So if interested kayo, Let's just get started. Okay, so since dito na nga tayo mag-aaral, like stay at home lang tayo, ito na yung parang magiging classroom natin, it is important for us to have a desk or an area wherein dun lang tayo gagawa ng mga school works and dun lang tayo mag-focus about school stuffs. So, ayun, mahalaga na meron tayong work area, desk, ganyan. And, it is important yung desk natin is ilagay natin guys wherein merong direct sunlight or lighting na from the sun, ganun. Kasi, sa experience ko guys, pag ako nag-aaral, na mas nagiging mag-productive ako, like, girl, mag-aaral ako, ganun. Pero yung pag yung ilaw talaga sa, sa bahay, is parang hindi naman sa nakakatamad, pero parang mas productive lang ako kapag direct sunlight. And yun na, basa research, mas ano siya effective. The next thing is gadgets. Yes. Mahalaga ngayon guys ang gadgets and chills siya ngayon since online na lahat ng mga mangyayari sa pag-aaral natin. So, ayun. And sometimes I'm, I used my tablet for my schedule. So, ayan. Nagdalawad ako ng color note wherein it's just like that. So, ngayon, 27. This is the things I'll be doing. And, i-check ko siya dyan pag once I'm done. So, ayun. Pagganahan nyo lang guys yung mga things na meron kayo and I'll definitely assuring you na magiging productive yung araw nyo. You guys need a laptop and if you don't have, okay, you can use your phone. Simply your phone kasi marami na magagawa guys sa cellphone, right? Pwede tayo mag-edit din ng mga schoolworks, like sa Word, ganyan. Mag-download tayo ng app. Or pagganahin natin kung ano man yung meron tayo. Like, gamitin natin siya ng tayo. The next thing is headset or yan, earphones. Kasi, di ba, magkakaroon na tayo ng mga Zoom meeting, um, discussions na online. So, mas maganda na mas ma magsuot tayo ng headset para mas maintindihan natin yung discussions ng prof natin or ng teachers natin. Okay, I know na digitally inclined na tayo ngayon since yun nga, magiging online na nga lahat. But, for me, okay, personally, gusto ko pa rin talaga na I have my own planner. Like, masusulatan nyo talaga. Okay, for me, sabihin natin na pwede natin ilagay yung to-do list natin sa phone. But then, guys, importante pa rin na meron tayong planner. Like, yan. Kasi, ba diba, pag sa cellphone, okay, nagsusulat tayo ng ating to-do list. And then, nag-notif ang ating Facebook. So, madi-distract tayo and baka mawala pa ta sa atin yung focus natin na, okay, ano ba yung ilagay ko sa to-do list ko, ganyan-ganyan. So, in, it is important for us to have a planner pa rin na ganito, yung mahahawakan natin, hindi like digital thingy. So, ayun. Um, you can put here your to-do list. So, ayan, I have this. Ayan, yung grade 12 ba yan. So, ilagay ko yung mga to-do list ko. And then, pag na-accomplish ko, makikita natin, guys. Ayan, may check na. And super sarap lang sa feeling kapag na-accomplish mo na or natapos mo na lahat ng deadlines mo by the end of the day. So, planner is a must for you guys. For us, guys. Hindi ko alam kung kailangan ko pa itong itakaw. But, of course, we need a Wi-Fi para tayo kakonect sa ating chill world kung wala tayong Wi-Fi. So, ayun, pwede rin data or pocket Wi-Fi. So, basta guys, ganunin natin kung ano man yung meron sa atin ngayon. Ikk na buho ko yan. OMG, God! Kasi kinulot ako ni Ashley yung pisan ko. Guys, so on my social media. But then, yeah. Okay, this is like based on my personal things. But, I highly recommend for you guys to always... My favorite, 
iced coffee. Oh my god. Because this can help me to stay awake and hindi antok yan sa mga klase since maraming ang tuksong mga yari do sa bahay, di ba? So we can just use our phone, do the things na hindi productive. But iced coffee is a must for me kasi yun nga, magiging awake ako and parang good start sa araw. Ganun. Moving on, kaya ako ngayon ng mga tips sa inyo kung paano tayo magiging productive lalo sa ating akads or what especially here in our house first thing is you need to have like a self discipline so kailangan natin maging disiplinado like i-focus natin sarili natin na kapag okay simula na yung klase is i-focus lang natin yung utak natin sa school works or school stuffs ayan i-disregard muna natin yung mga bagay na hindi school related I know guys, super hirap pero challenge ourselves na gawin yun. The next thing is time management. Okay, sinabi ko nga kanina na we need planner, di ba? So, ayan, pwede tayong magawa dito guys ng timeline. Yung ba tama tawag doon? Yung parang 7am, ito yung gagawin ko. By 8.30 kailangan tapos na ako and then moving on na ako sa next kong gagawin. So, mga ganon, guys. Kasi, very effective yon para mas magamit natin ng ayos yung ating oras ng productive and walang masayang na oras na tenga lang tayo, ganon. So, next thing is try to have a mindset na okay, kailangan ko tong gawin, kailangan ko tong matapos at kailangan ko tong simulan ngayon na. Guys, before yung mindset ko is, okay, malayo pa naman yung deadline nito. So, bukas na lang, ganon. Importante, gawin nyo na. Kung kaya nyo ngayon, gawin nyo na. Bakit? Mas magiging maayos kasi matatapos nyo siya ng mas maaga. So, kung meron mang maidagdag na school works yung iba nyong prof or iba nyong teachers na gagawin, magiging mas chill na kayo and then magpo-focus na kayo dun sa next subject na yun. And if you don't have this or what, basta wag lang tayo guys mag- gawa sa ating bed kasi baka tayo tama rin or what pick a spot we're in magiging maayos yung parang study thingy natin so ayun okay for taking down notes or what I highly suggest for you to use the highlighters kasi for me basically I really love doing that kasi it makes me feel motivated about myself na, okay, keep going, just do your thing, ganon. So, ayun. Ayan. Stuff like that. Let's be honest here, na kapag colorful yung notes natin, mas um, sinisiglahan tayo na gawin yung mga bagay-bagay, rather than seeing our notes plain. Okay, for example, like this. Okay, diba parang, girl, parang nakakatamad, ganon. So, but then, let's make it colorful, let's playful, ganon, para mas maging productive tayo. So, ayun guys yung mga bagay na ma-share ko sa inyo. Before I end this video, I would like to tell you guys na importante pa rin ang self-care especially during this kind of um, pandemic. But, also, gamitin natin ng maayos yung mga oras natin while nandito tayo sa bahay. Don't waste our time doing nothing or doing like hindi naman um, sa tingin natin makakatulong sa atin. So, if you guys have um, free time, you can watch different kinds of educational things, educational video, or if na meron na kayong schedule ng inyong subjects, or meron na kayong um, tayo na yung mga subject ano nyo, pwede nyo mag-advance reading na rin kayo. Kasi guys, one click lang yan sa internet. You can search, ganon. So, yun guys yung mga bagay na masasabi ko sa video na to. And hindi pa nag-start yung klase namin, guys. Ito rin ako guys sa mga bagay-bagay na kailangan. So, ayun. Currently, I'm doing the requirements and ayun. Sa inyo na pala ako papasok. So, National yan. Future national yan. Char. So, ayun, guys. Thank you, thank you so much for watching. I hope this video will be helpful for you. And, ayun, guys. See you on my next one.